idea of a new academic center for Benedictine College has its roots back in a board retreat back in April of 2004. Since then there has been a lot of discussion and planning by everyone on the board and they decided it was time to take the next step. The 50 million dollar investing in excellence campaign was a bold move by this board and by this college. It's the largest campaign in the history of the college, four times larger than anything the college has ever attempted before. One of its key components was the funding of an academic center, a new signature building that will sit on the bluff overlooking the Missouri River and would address our needs for classroom space, faculty space, and meeting space for years to come. Seeing the progress that the college has made over the, the past 25 years has been amazing. The beautification of the campus, the new buildings, it, the increase of students, the increased programs makes me proud of my alma mater and very proud to be an alum here. This is a great day for Benedictine College. It is especially a great day for the young men and women who choose Benedictine College to become their home. This new academic building will support education, business, theology, and philosophy faculty to be even better at our passion for teaching and our contributions to what is uniquely Benedictine College, educating men and women in a community of faith and scholarship. It excites me when I come to this campus and I interact with students and how excited they are to be a part of this. And I know colleges all around the country and all around the world are having an impact on students. I think very few have the full rounded impact that this institution does. So that the students and, and uh, their parents, that's significant commitment. Lastly, I, I thank the donors uh, that make this possible. Uh, as, as many have indicated, this is an unbelievable campaign and the fact that we have crested $50 million is beyond the imagination of many that are standing here uh, today. It's very nice for all of us to be a part of this highly significant step in building one of the great Catholic colleges of America. Thank you. Thank you, Steve. This is indeed a momentous occasion, and we're about to move on to the matter at hand, the groundbreaking ceremony. It is my pleasure to introduce the participants in today's ceremony who will take their places as I call their names. First, the Chairman of the Board of Directors at Benedictine College, Jim O'Brien. The President of Benedictine College, Stephen D. Minnis. Mick and Marlis Haverty. Dave and Sherry Laughlin. Steve Dunn of J.E. Dunn Construction, the building contractor. Denton Nichols, the architect who did the building design at Trainer Architects. Dick Tillman of Trainer Architects. And the mayor of Atchison, Andrew Waring. Our dignitaries are in place, and I would now ask the prioress, Anne, to join me for the blessing. And may the Lord bless all who teach and learn here. May he bless all who've contributed to make it possible. May he bless all the new students, like the young men and women on the chalk line here, who are here for a sore weekend, S-O-A-R, uh, new to enroll here in the fall. So, ladies and gentlemen, turn your spades. I wondered what was in the tubes. 